Okay, welcome to St. Louis. Engines running, no sign of any law enforcement. Now listen close. There's eight of you on that starting line, and I want you to fight for the finish like your lives legit depend on it. Don't ask me where we're heading. You'll find out when you get there. Just follow the signs. It's the only way through. Now go! That's why you can, Travis, because it's not gonna be clear sailing for long. open. Something's blocking the road up there. I'm not sure any of you actually broke a sweat on that one. 
Well, we've got a gift headed our way. A serious weather warning for the next leg. From where I'm sitting, this is about to get fun. Special hotline, do not approach. Hope you had a good time with all those pretty balloons on the last leg. The winds of change are in the air. Keep your hands and your arms inside the vehicle at all times, kiddos. And as always, follow the signs. Watch out! Obstacle coming up fast! Keep your eyes open. Something's blocking the road up there. What? An idiot? That truck driver doesn't understand the first thing about wind shear. See that sawmill that looks kind of like a movie set? I'm diverting the race path to hit. Crosswind. The desert's angry. Or maybe just impatient for a good race. Gonna mean a lot of debris and stuff out there. Don't crash your sexy little cars. Tell you a little something about wind and gravity. They get into lots of trouble together. Goes up, and there we go. Nature one, chimney zero. Okay, I talked about taking risks. Well, I'm not diverting the race path this time. I want all of you driving into the heart of that dust storm. Brace yourselves. This is why you're here. I gotta say, I enjoyed that. That dust storm would be like sandpaper against your skin if you were out there in it. If you gotta go through hell, might as well do it in a car, right? That dust storm might be strong enough to sand the paint off a car, but it's gonna make one hell of a backdrop for our next leg. Might be tricky to follow the signs, but follow the you shall. Those gusts of wind pushing against your cars. Those are the gods of the desert challenging you to be worthy of this. Come on, push yourselves. Show me you've got what it takes.
I mentioned might actually be pleased with you. Me? Well, I'll withhold judgment till I see how the last two legs go. This ordeal is very far from over. If I were a glass half full kind of person, I'd say the dust storms passed, and you kids are past the halfway point, but I'm more of a realist. The roads are a mess, there's rescue teams to watch out for, and a whole lot of ways things could still go wrong. Keep your heads on.
fine turn. The real opposite of ideal racing conditions, huh? races on TV, and they were just never good enough. So I started running my own. What kind of person drives full throttle into a dust storm at nearly 200 miles per hour? The kind I respect. Just one more leg, and it's going to be an all-out sprint to our finish line and the city of sin. Vegas has always been a place of winners and losers, and it's about to get seven more. Here's the deal. Clear roads all the way to Las Vegas. Cross the finish line, taking the sights. Hell, you can even stay for a vacation for all I care. Just make this last leg a good one for me. One to Vegas drives aboard and flies off to a sort of victory celebration. My advice to all of you, be aboard that plane. Just trust me. Something's blocking the road up there.
Hey, there's something in the road ahead. Careful now. of you is worthy of which of you is dust. Winner, you oppressed me out there, and I don't say that easily. You've earned that price, car, and something else too. Seems you're not flying to a victory party. This race was just the beginning, and you are gonna love what comes next.